A drip campaign is a series of automated messages like emails or text messages sent to a group of people over a set period of time. These messages are generally designed to be relevant and valuable to the recipient and gradually lead them towards a specific goal such as making a purchase or signing up for a service or some other desired goal that is relevant to your business. In this video, we will look at how to set up those drip campaigns using Watermate. Let's dive into the demo. After you log into our platform, navigate to the automation section under communications. Here you can review all the previously installed automation rules. But in this instance, I want to create a new rule from the scratch that actually sends the drip campaign to my customers as such. So I'm going to click on add rule template and I'm going to click on create rule from scratch since I want to create a rule from the scratch. Here I'm going to give it a name, call it drip campaign automate. So in, in this instance, I have several triggers uh, in the automation rule, but what I want to do is I want to trigger the drip campaign when a new client is created in my account. Let's say someone books an appointment or someone makes an order with my business or someone books a class with my business. These are scenarios where a client would be created and I can also create clients in bulk by uploading a CSV file within the platform. Those are additional scenarios where a new client will be created. So I'm going to use that option to trigger the drip campaign. And here, if I want to filter out or send different drip campaigns to different clients, I have the ability to do so. And under the conditions, I have client tags as well. So I can add different tags to each of my clients and then categorize different clients into different segments and, and, and run different drip campaigns as well. For the demo purpose, I'm not going to use any conditions. Uh, I want to run a generic drip campaign for all my clients. The next thing that I want to do is I want to send a WhatsApp template message and I can choose a predefined template that's already in my account or I can go to go to the uh, integration section under WhatsApp. I can create a new WhatsApp template as well, which is explained in another video. I'm going to hear here. I'm going to search for the welcome message because that's where that's the first message that I want to send to my client when they get created in the database. And this is what helps me with creating that drip experience by adding wait time. I can add um, how long do I need to wait before I can send this message. I can define it in hours, in days or weeks or even months if, if your business requires that. So I'm going to I'm, I'm not going to add wait time for the first message. I'm, I want the first message to be sent as soon as a new client is created and the following messages I can I can add that wait time to create that trip experience such. So here um, I have a variable where I can personalize the message. So I'm going to use the personalization option to personalize this message to my client. Client.name will replace when the message is sent, it will be replaced with the client's actual name. I have an image for this message, so I can choose an image as well. I'm going to click on add message and I have a welcome image that I have in my database. I want to use that for the first message. And then I can keep creating as many messages as I want and I can keep on adding that wait time to create that trip experience. And it's it's not just WhatsApp message, you can also send an email. So I, I can add an email action as well. And here I can choose the recipient to client associated and I can set up the subject as well. Welcome to what I made. And I have an email template that I have already set up. I'm just going to use that to 
we save the time I've just copied uh, my own template that I've previously set up and that has um, a good experience on the email with the personalization variable client.name and and even the email has that personalization experience if you want to add more variables you can always type in hash and the email editor will actually display the personalization variables available for you and for the first email i don't want to add any wait time i want that's this email to be sent as soon as um, the trigger occurs but the next message i want to send a template message again but here I want to wait for one day before I send this message. So I'm adding this wait time. And then I've already set up a template and I hope it's called um, new trial follow up. Here I've set up a message saying, um, you know, hope you have been enjoying our platform so far. We wanted to let you know that we are just a message away just to just to nudge the customer saying that we are just a message away and if they need any support they can always reach out to us and I want to personalize this message as well so I'm going to use the personalization variable as you can see here I'm able to create two messages with a set interval as such and I can keep on adding as many messages as I want and there is no limit to our uh, automation rule that you need to have only certain number of actions you can have even 10 messages to be sent across over a period of your trial period um, 14 days or whatever it is you can set up that uh, messages with the proper wait time and it will keep sending the messages at regular period as such for this demo purpose i'm just gonna review it one more time and i'm gonna save it as such okay so I can always go in and review it is created and it is in active status now let's just test it out I can add a new client uh, by adding the client manually or I can do a bulk import as well by uploading a CSV if you've got the sample file for this demo purpose I'm just going to add a new client with an existing number I'm going to call it Arjun Babu. Choose in country. And this is where I can add tags if I want to segment the customers. But in this instance, I want to run my campaign for all my clients. I'm just going to save it. And now that my client is created, as you can see here, I've received the welcome with the personalization that I've set up. After a day, I should also receive the following message as well. Thank you for watching our channel. If you'd like to know more about our platform, please subscribe to our channel and watch other videos on our channel. And if you'd like to sign up for a free trial, there's the link in the description, click on it and sign up for free.